Now to your top 10 headlines in just two minutes. The National Weather Service confirms Tuolumne County experienced an EF1 tornado yesterday. It was on the ground for nearly a mile near Tuttletown. That's west of Sonora. Six more counties have been added to the state's emergency proclamation. That includes areas hit by yesterday's intense thunderstorms and flash flooding. This photo is from Copperopolis in Calaveras County. It shows flash flooding on Copper Cove Drive. The Public Works Department is working to get that section of road back open as soon as possible. The Oscars work with the Air Force for a flyover 1,000 feet above today's award show, but the clouds were so thick it was hard to see the flyover meant to honor Top Gun Maverick and to also start the show with a bang. The Modesto Fire Department responded to three separate buildings on fire yesterday. The first was in a shed off a home on Filbert Drive. The second was a house fire on Pamela Lane. Four people were displaced by this fire. The third was at a restaurant downtown on I Street. Eight people are dead after two boats flipped over off the coast of San Diego. Police think the boats may have been part of a human smuggling operation. First responders tracked the boats through a 911 call. Fairfield police are now asking for your help identifying this man. He was seen stealing a safe at a small business on North Texas Street. It happened in the early morning hours of March 5th. If you have any information, reach out to Fairfield police. A man was rescued from the Yolo Bypass near West Sacramento. Responding agencies used a fan boat to get to the man, and he was taken to the hospital shortly after being rescued. This man was rescued on the Salinas River near King City in Monterey County. The man was driving his car when it was washed away by floodwaters. He was able to get to this island in the middle of the river where he waited for help. And take a look at this. Helicopter crews had to drop nearly 7,000 pounds of hay to stranded cows in Humboldt County. Deep snow and down trees are blocking ranchers from getting to the cows. It's important that the cows get proper nutrition because this is the time of year when cows give birth. And those are your top 10 headlines in just two minutes.